Hi everyone, this is Angie at MyNameIsAngie.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to set up the plugin All-in-One SEO Pack. Let me show you what this plugin is going to do for you. This plugin is going to give you a very simple way to set up the title and description and keywords associated with your site, but not just with your site as a whole, with the individual posts and pages on your site. So here's an example of what you'll be able to do with this. You can see here I've searched for Team Columbus Chevy. I'm looking for the website of a group of five Columbus natives who are going down to Austin to South by Southwest courtesy of Chevy to compete in a road trip challenge and along the way they're raising money for teachers here in Columbus. So anyway, so I'm trying to find that website and so I've searched for Team Columbus Chevy. Well what I found, the very first result, Chevy South by Southwest Team Columbus. And you can see right under that, you can see the description of the site. Team Seabus is the story of five Seabusters competing on behalf of the city of Columbus in the Chevy South by Southwest Road Trip Challenge. Now this plugin is going to give you the ability to easily write that description here and change it when you need to and make sure that what your title says is what you need it to say but then also work with the keywords that are happening in the background on your site so let me go ahead and show you how to do that so we're here at the dashboard we've already installed the plugin all-in-one SEO pack and if you don't know how to do that you just quickly go to plugins click on add new search for all-in-one SEO pack click install and activate and then what you'll see is this link at the top that says go to the admin page to enable and configure the plugin. So that's what we're going to do. You can ignore all of this up at the top. Kind of just scroll down a bit and the very first thing that we want to do is tell the plugin status to be enabled. Obviously it doesn't help to have this plugin activated if it's not enabled. You can also disable this plugin at any time if you need to. So the home title for example for my site is my name is Angie your WordPress website coach. So that's what you can, you know, make the homepage title the title of your website, obviously. The home description is, for example, on this, you know, on this search, it was the team C bus is the story of five C busters, all of that. On my site, it might be something like, you know, my name is my name is Angie is your place for WordPress coaching and video tutorials to learn themes and plugins. So you want that to be, you want it to have your keywords in it, but you want it to be a sentence and you want it to make sense to someone who's reading it like a sentence. It's not just a whole bunch of words with commas in between them. And it needs to be no more than 160 characters, not words, characters. So keep that in mind as you're writing your description. And then for the home keywords, that's where you can just write a, a list of comma separated words, WordPress, plugins, themes, Columbus, Ohio, Angie, uh, tutorials, you know that sort of thing things that are related to your to the content of your site and to your target market that's what goes there the next thing that we want to change you can leave these two things just the way they are and the next thing that we want to change is under post title format and as well the page title format we want to delete everything that comes after page uh, percentage page title percentage we want to delete that so you can see kind of how that ends up right there and the reason that is is because right now it's telling um, it's telling your post title and your page titles to be post title separator blog title and we don't want that that dilutes the the strength of your blog title in SEO return so just delete those now everywhere else the only other thing that we want to do the whole way down is replace that separator with a dash and that's it. And I'm not going to take the time to do that the whole way down because I have something else I want to show you. Everything else here you can just leave just the way it is. So scroll down to the bottom, click update options, and that's it. Now what's really powerful about this particular plugin is the, you know, the fact that you can go in and easily change those things but also that it gives you the option to do that for every post and page too. So here you can see I've got the post open from yesterday, my favorite plugins, and I'm going to scroll down to the bottom now and I have this whole new box here where I can write a custom title just for this post and a custom description just for this post. And I can add in keywords for this post. And so do that for every post and page that you write, follow that and add a title, a description, and a keyword, and that will just start boosting up your content in the search engine. So that's it. That's all in one SEO pack. Briefly, how to use it. Thank you.